Move and Learn project has been running for the past seven years um, based around health and nutrition, healthy body, healthy mind and as well as getting kids moving and trying different physical activity. Um, this year in particular we've piloted the new programme so we've been chosen out of all of the, uh, the PFL clubs to trial the new programme um, and we're currently in the middle of that six week block at the minute. Two boys are fantastic. You know, we had Jan Songo and Ruben Ramirez in today. Uh, the kids were starstruck straight away. Um, but just seeing the engagement with the players and the children, and I, I know the impact that's going to have on them moving forwards now. Uh, for some of them, massive Argyle fans, you know, that, that will live with them forever. So for them to come in and be part of our programme as part of EFL Action Day, I, I couldn't thank them enough um, for how they've been and, and the help they put out in the uh, practical session itself. You know, helping people that are maybe not football orientated to do football skills that maybe they never thought they'd be able to do um, was just outstanding. It's important what you put in your body because um, ultimately it gives you the energy and um, you know helps you sleep better. So um, you now to come out here with Jan and um, you know come and spoke to a few of the kids and see how how they're getting on. It's been amazing. You know, be around the kids. I have a really fun time. You know, come here with uh, Ruben. Uh, I think it's really important, you know, to give back to the community. So, you know, I really have fun and bring back memories when I was a kid. So it was a really good time. In terms of the local lot, they go to watch the team. So they are well aware of Plymouth Argyle and what it offers. Um, we've got certain children that obviously play football lots. But once we've got children that don't play as football, they think, well, hang on, there's more to here than just playing Plymouth Argyle football. There are lots of other sports they get involved with. Um, so we have children that are maybe not as active, suddenly become active. So today was just another day for us, but then we find out that it's a nationwide um, EFL in action. We just thought this is great. It's another like cherry on the top. These children seeing these um, professional footballers, not only inspiring the footballers amongst us, but also the children that don't normally play sport. You know, if, if you can get out of the house and, and do something you enjoy and um, you know, stay healthy and fit at the same time, it's always a bonus. So it's good to, um, you know, to give back sometimes to the community. I think we, we feel the support when we play. And you know, doing things like this, maybe going to see kids and seeing people that um, you know, can take um, an inspiration from what we do, if you, if you can call it that. So it's really good to just give back and, and, and put a smile on their faces. I just think this is just brilliant. At the end of the day, the aim is the children are involved in sport and I guarantee that come the summer months, everyone will be involved in playing the games that Plymouth Argyle have invited us to play. Brilliant.